Hello there. That is such a great question. So the reason I turn my head is one, because I'm taking on a different character. So as an example, I'm kind of looking away, grabbing the next accent and taking on how that person would say the sentence that I've been asked to say. So it's kind of like um, accessing in, in my brain uh, the part of me that requires me to grab, you know, how I need to do the accent. Because like when you're doing loads of different accents, you know, you've, you've your brain's firing on as many cylinders as you've got, right? And so, you know, when I'm doing the accents, I'm kind of like, which accent am I doing? What what sort of physical behaviour comes with that accent? Because, of course, when you're doing an accent, you kind of breathe differently. Your facial expressions change. Like, when I'm doing, like, a Cockney accent, like, my mouth is, like, I, I use, like, the bottom part of my mouth. And so it's that bit wider in the way that I talk. It's the same with the New York accent, you know, like it's wider. Um, but of course, with British RP, you know, there's not a lot of facial movement. I'm not doing so much. So, yeah, I think it's more about jumping out of the moment and coming back in with a fresh take on the sentence. And it's also about grabbing the accent from the sky, bringing it into me and making sure that I do it all properly for you. I, I hope that explains it. Loving this filter, darling. So glamorous.